Are you feeling stuck in your life because of certain habits? It's a question that many of us, particularly men, grapple with. We often find ourselves caught in a web of routines, repeating the same patterns that leave us feeling unfulfilled, stagnant, and weak. Imagine a world where you're continuously popping pills to solve problems like depression or ADHD, only to find that they're merely a band-aid, not a cure. The root cause is still there, festering beneath the surface. It's a common scenario, isn't it? We've become a society that's quick to medicate, to find instant solutions without considering the long-term consequences, or exploring natural, holistic alternatives. Now let's shift our focus to the digital realm. We're all guilty of spending a little too much time on platforms like Instagram or OnlyFans, aren't we? But when this consumption of adult content becomes excessive, it warps our perception of reality, achievement, and ourselves. It's a distraction, a dependency, and it's keeping us weak. We're also living in a time where we're bombarded with news and current events. It's easy to get sucked into the whirlwind of debates and discussions, losing sight of personal growth and improvement. It's another habit that's holding us back. And who can forget the allure of video games? They're fun, they're engaging, but when we spend an excessive amount of time on them, we're missing out on real-world experiences that contribute to our growth and development. Finally, there's the issue of poor sleep hygiene. We often overlook the importance of quality sleep, ignoring factors like light exposure, temperature, and bedtime routines. But these factors significantly impact our overall well-being and productivity. These are just five of the habits that are keeping men weak. There are misconceptions about them, strategies to overcome them, and benefits to be reaped from breaking free. But if I tell you that these habits can be changed, and you can break free from these constraints, would you be willing to give it a try? Suppose you find yourself reaching for a pill every time you feel a bit off. Does that sound like you? Here's the thing, friends. We live in a society that often looks for a quick fix, a magic pill if you will, to solve our problems. And sure, prescription drugs can offer temporary relief, but they're not a cure-all. So, what's the misconception here that popping a pill is the only solution to your problems? But let's shift our perspective a bit. What if, instead of reaching for that pill, you reach for a healthier lifestyle? Start by eating right, exercising regularly, and practicing mindfulness. Now, you may be thinking, what's the point? Well, the benefits of this strategy are manifold. You'll feel healthier, more energetic, and more in control of your life. Remember, you are more than just a prescription. You have the strength to overcome. Now imagine you're spending hours scrolling through Instagram or glued to adult content. Does that ring a bell? We've all been there, caught in the digital web, our minds numbed by an endless stream of pictures and videos. It's a common misconception that this is just harmless downtime, but in reality, it's a habit that's eating away at our time and mental health, distorting our perception of achievement and success. So what's the solution? Start by setting boundaries. Limit your screen time, unfollow accounts that don't add value to your life, and replace this habit with healthier alternatives like reading or exercising. The benefits? Well, you'll regain control over your time, reduce anxiety, and increase your focus on real-life goals. Remember, the digital world is fleeting. The real world, however, is where you live, grow, and make a difference. Realize that your worth is not defined by the digital world, but by your real-world actions and achievements. Picture this. You're always tuned into the latest news, arguing about current events. Sound familiar? It's easy to fall into the trap of becoming a news junkie, especially in our hyper-connected world. The misconception? Some of us believe that staying informed means spending hours diving into the depths of every breaking story. But this habit can distract us from focusing on our personal development. So what's the solution? Try allocating a specific time each day for catching up on the news and stick to it. This way, you'll stay informed without letting it consume your daily routine. The benefits? You'll find yourself with more time and mental energy to invest in activities that contribute to your growth and betterment. You might be surprised at how much you can accomplish when you're not constantly reacting to the latest headline. Remember, your personal growth and improvement should be your priority, not the latest headline. Imagine you're spending most of your time in a virtual world battling enemies or racing cars. Does that seem like you? We're diving headfirst into the realm of excessive gaming. It's a common misconception that gaming is just a harmless hobby, a way to blow off some steam, but when it takes up a significant chunk of your time, leaving little room for real-world activities, it becomes a problem. So how do we combat this gaming gluttony? Start by setting boundaries allocate a specific amount of time for gaming and stick to it. 
Replace gaming hours with activities that contribute to your personal growth. Explore a new hobby, take up a sport, or learn a new language. The benefits? They're endless. You'll notice an improvement in your productivity, your interpersonal relationships will flourish, and you'll start achieving real-world goals. Realize that real-world achievements are far more rewarding than virtual victories. Now envision you're neglecting your sleep, always pushing it to the bottom of your priority list. Is that you? A common misconception about sleep is that it's a luxury, not a necessity. Some even wear their lack of sleep like a badge of honor, boasting about how they can function on just a few hours a night. But let's bust this myth. Sleep is as essential to our health as food and water. It's not about quantity, but quality. To improve your sleep hygiene, establish a consistent sleep schedule. Turn off electronic devices at least an hour before bedtime. Keep your sleep environment dark, quiet, and cool. Implementing these strategies can have remarkable benefits. You'll feel more energized, focused, and productive. Your mood will improve and so will your overall health. Remember, quality sleep is the foundation of a quality life. Don't be a sleep saboteur. Instead, prioritize sleep and reap the benefits of a well-rested body and mind. So, are you ready to break free from these habits that are keeping you weak? It's time to reflect on what we've uncovered today. We've learned about the pitfalls of dependency on prescription drugs, the crucial importance of addressing the root causes of our issues rather than seeking quick fixes. We've also discussed the dangers of spending too much time consuming adult content and becoming distracted from our real-life goals. Remember it's equally important not to let current events and news consume your valuable time and energy that could be better spent on personal growth. And let's not forget the hours lost to excessive gaming, time that could be used for real-world activities that contribute to your development. Finally, we've highlighted the importance of good sleep hygiene, the foundation of productivity, and overall well-being. You can start making these changes today. It's not an overnight process, but every step you take is a step towards a stronger, more empowered you. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video. Your journey towards strength and empowerment begins now.